There is a major storm on the other side of the world as well. Hundreds of thousands of people are being evacuated on the Philippines island of Luzon as Typhoon Mankut approaches with winds of more than 250 kilometres an hour. It's due to make landfall on the northern tip of Luzon over the weekend. Up to 10 million people are in the storm's path. Rajid Ahmad now reports. Heavy rocks tying down houses in the north in the hope it might save the roofs of their vulnerable homes when Typhoon Mankut arrives. The Philippines is hit by about 20 typhoons and storms a year, the destruction killing hundreds and leaving millions in a cycle of poverty. But this super typhoon has been described as the strongest yet of 2018. Schools and offices have been ordered shut, thousands are evacuating. At about 900 kilometres in diameter, the storm is expected to pack powerful wind speeds with heavy rains triggering landslides and flash floods. Storm surges too are a big threat, with high waves likely to inundate the coastline. The, the biggest fear is for the estimated 10 million people in the path of the storm, with worries authorities and rescue services will be stretched thin. But the important thing is for the government to make sure that evacuation happens, that in evacuation centers there's no panic, and that we could provide food, that the government is ready with food. Officials don't want to see a repeat of super typhoon Haiyan, which killed thousands in 2013, affecting millions of people, many forced from their homes. <laughs> this time, as people prepare and stock up on supplies, some even say they plan to stay in the hope they can protect their property. As super typhoon Mankut draws ever closer. Regid Ahmed, BBC News.